Ladies and gentlemen, welcome faces to a new dawn and a new day in Banff, the beautiful city in, I was going to say Alberta, but I don't know if it is, Canada. Look at him! <laughs> Best auntie and uncle ever, bro! Uh oh, that doesn't look good. How am I supposed to have fun without the funions? That is what I'm talking about. Can I test? <laughs> oh yes, dude. This is a sick pad. Oh my god, it's huge. Hmm. You may explode. Bro, I literally look like your, your child. Change your name on Facebook. Otherwise you don't exist. Well, well, well. Would you look at that? We are starting our day walking around this lovely city. I got myself some hydration for the nation. And we're about to find out what shopping and shops this town has to offer until we abandon it and leave to start our next adventure. I feel like every day you guys tune in or whenever it is for a next vlog, you never know what's gonna happen next because we're just making up as we go along. And I think that's the perfect way to vlog. So cheers. Banff be looking picturesque as anything, but look at Lydia with the fashion icon statements. She's got the pink drink, she's got the white top, she's got the beige and white, oh my lordy. She, she's a model. Now we've been hiking, adventuring, jumping into open water lakes. But today we're switching it up with a bit of retail therapy. My lady would like some new clothes for our adventure whilst we're on, cause she's been wearing the same stuff about 10 days. And as you guys know, when we travel, um, we don't check luggage, no, we take a small carry-on, so we've got like five t-shirts to ourselves, hence why you see me wearing the same thing again and again and again. So Lydia will be picking herself up a few more assortments for the road. And I'm doing the typical guy thing where you do like the slow walk around the shop, you look at things, you don't care for it, you look at your phone and you rinse and repeat. Ah yes, ultimate man goal achieved, I found a place to sit and I will stay here till the end. Time to play RuneScape. Seven hours later. <laughs> oh my god, is this what is this what the sky and fresh air is like? Ooh. Lydia's walked out with the entire shop. No. And uh <laughs> I have to tell a tale real quick. Like I got hit with a bit of an emotional roller coaster in there. So I'm sat down on the edge just in the window, chilling out playing RuneScape. And this guy comes over to me and says, like, hey Tom, just wanted to say hello, like watch the videos, but more so he went, Do you remember Alec? And I was like, mm, there's only one Alec I like think of when you say that name and that's who I did the make a wish with I feel like I'm already getting emotional because I was doing in there he comes over and he's like yeah I was like his best friend and he showed me a picture and it was him and Alec and I was like what the heck is going on like how do how have you bumped into me? he's like yeah I'm from Calgary where Alec was from and we're just over here in Banff and he was just like I just wanted to say thank you for everything that you did for him and I was like oh mate it hit me so much in the feels like I almost started crying in the shop I was gonna start I was gonna start like vlogging it and everything but um, I was a little bit of an emotional wreck in there, but I just wanted to say to the lad that I just met, thank you so much. If I can get a picture, I'll put it on screen now and then a picture of him and Alec, because like, what are the chances of that? I could have been in any store, I could have been in a different city, I could have been anywhere, and I bumped into this guy and he just said like, thank you so much for everything you've done for him. And I was just like, oh man, I was not ready for this emotional roller coaster. So yet again, another reason why my audience are absolutely amazing. All right, so for a bit of a change of energy and atmosphere, um, I was getting emotional there. Here's a raccoon sticking his head through a glass window. <laughs> what? This one's got a great name, having a bad feather day. <laughs> oh no, it was a bird that fell in the water. That is, that is funny that it just looks at me like, why did you do this to me? Oh, it, now if we saw this in the wild, I would freak out. A little bear in the tree, a baby bear, cute. Two baby bears in the tree, even cuter. I'm not even kidding. The amount of free time I have in my life sometimes makes me wish I was a wildlife photographer because these shots are so worth it. Look at him! <laughs> to say how cute he is there to how mean he's going to grow up to be. Flipping heck. Absolute madness. Some of these pictures are... Oh, Lid, imagine if you saw that walking towards you. You would be dead. There's two grizzly bears in Bam. There's one called Split Lip and one called The Boss. And that's The Boss. And the, and the reason why the other one's called Split Lip is because that one ripped its jaw like to pieces to the point where the park rangers had to like sedate it and operate on it to like help so it because really it was that bad. So if you saw that one, you need to fucking run. And even madder, if a brown bear comes at you, you're supposed to like, you know, make yourself dead big and like, back away and like scare it off. 
If a grizzly comes towards you and it's gonna charge you, you're supposed to lay down on your stomach, put your hands on your head to try and outlast the attack because it will try ripping you apart and by laying on your stomach, you've got to protect your vital organs and putting your hands on your head inside of your temple is to protect your brain from brain damage. So brown bear, scare it off. Grizzly bear, get shredded to pieces and hope it doesn't kill you. What is that about? Come on, look at those. <laughs> they are so cute. <laughs> Owl babies. In the Owl babies. Oh, this is just such a good shot. This is an absolutely incredible shot. Yeah, that's where we went yesterday. Yeah. Wow. Uh, just stupid. Canada is crazy beautiful. It smells like fresh bakery. I love it. She loves it. Wow. I am in my element in like different country supermarkets because I just love what they have to see. Like, what's what's in here? What is this? Maple walnut ice cream? I love it. Big feckle sausages. Size doesn't matter sausages. Human style rabbit food. Full on Chinese meals in a supermarket, what the heck? Godlike looking pastries, oh my days. And much, much more. This is, this is, you wanna get cultured somewhere where you go, just go into a supermarket, it's amazing. Looking at getting an ice cream for Lydia, but the queue goes not just round the shop, but out the door and all the way to the end of there. How much do you want ice cream? <laughs> Not that much. Okay, the ice cream tea might be long, but you've got Dairy Potter, Moodlorian, <laughs> Moo Craft, <laughs> Moochie, and Cow Cow Chanel. <laughs> I like it. Right, after nearly 10 days of being in Canada, I've just got my first vlog live. It has uploaded into the universe, and I am hoping people are gonna enjoy it. Like, I just wanna throw this out here right now to every single person who ever leaves a like rating and leaves a comment down below of what they thought of the video. I appreciate you guys so much, but it has indeed gone live, and I can relax for another like week until I need to stress of getting internet uploading, checking the video and uploading it and getting it all edited with the Ryan, so. I need to celebrate with a drink. But before I do that, I'm going back into the print shop that we came past uh, when it was closed because I think we're going to pick up a little postcard. <gasps> they sell stickers. Yeah. Oh, wow, they sell stickers. I'll take one though, because that's good. That's a good one. Just wanted to throw some out here, a little detail. Uh, ignore the mountains. This is the post office in Banff. Look at that. Look at that for a door handle. How cute is that? Very nice detail. We have just written out our next postcard to Hello, because we uh, we are sending a postcard from everywhere we go. We're a little bit late with this one because this is from Jasper, but we're going to send it from Banff. And if we turn around, it's from when we went to a waterfall. We're going to send these along the way everywhere we go. We've got another one from Banff to send to Yeah, and we've got another one for Banff that we're going to go pick up. But the po like we just walked past for the post office, so we're going to go post that through there. But I, I love it because we're little Arlo. At little Arlo is officially four days old. Four days of entire, his entire life, that's crazy. So when he gets older, we'll just stash these all together to when he can read and then he'll have them forever. Best auntie and uncle ever, bro! And when in Canada, you go to a Mexican rooftop bar. <laughs> Very good. Because I am thirsty. Small, small tacos. Oh my God. And then nachos. That's nacho oh cheese. Wrap my cheese, that's good. I have to say this right now, I'm calling it. Magpie and Stump Rooftop Bar. Nachos are some of the best I've ever had in my life. Lydia? Yes. Let's say goodbye to Bam. Look how picturesque that is. Bam, 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 bam. We're in the road. Ah. Oh shit. <laughs> bam. <laughs> uh oh, that doesn't look good. We got a ticket. But we actually paid for parking. Yeah, we've actually got proof of parking that says till half past four. It says, so. yeah, 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 cast $55 fine. Failed to pay by parking. $36 if paid within a few days. Hmm. Well, I've got proof to be able to kind of like contest it. But as to how... Or where we go to do that? I have no idea. Wait, this get, they gave us the ticket at 1.11, two hours ago, what? I am all sorts of confused. Lydia spoke to someone and they said apparently it happens all the time, something to do with uh, British credit cards, not actually 
doing the payment. So we've got loads of proof of like timestamp on our phone, on the car, on my ticket and stuff like that. So hopefully it should just get waived. If it doesn't, this vlog is proof that we paid for, we parking. Paid for parking. Yesterday we did not. And we are, but no, but I did. We well, paid for it afterwards. I did actually pay for it afterwards. Look at that. Damn, some shitty camera. I didn't get a ticket then when I didn't buy a ticket, but the time that I haven't bought, I did buy a ticket, I got a ticket. What the fuck? Anyway, three and a half hour drive to Rebel Stoked. I'm just happy with the AC right now. Yeah, the AC's good, but we we'll really need to rock and roll. So uh, I'm just going to say this. If we have any stops along the way, we'll film it. If not, enjoy a little drive montage. Zoom, zoom to the room. We have made it to a middle stop destination to a place called Golden. It doesn't really look that golden, I'm not gonna lie. But we have indeed made it. We've probably only got an hour and a half left before we actually get into Revelstoke and we've received some epic news. We told Anthony, hey, we're gonna be going back past your place. Let's get together tonight for some drinks before we like leave tomorrow. And he was like, dude, I've just got my new house. So he's got the keys to his new house. We are gonna meet him there. We'll pick some beers up along the way and we'll go and celebrate with them. But first and foremost, it's time to have a stop off get some snacks some drinks and use the bathrooms so this is yet another gas station that i've actually not been in before and i can confirm i am disappointed because i do not see funyuns how am i supposed to have fun without the funyuns they're the ones everyone buys but they don't come out anything looking like spongebob it looks like a deformed melted version of spongebob <laughs> you want one you got a minion as well and i bet that's terrifying you want one no fine. okay we've got water we're ready to hit the road cowboy hat Interested? <laughs> I feel like the only people who buy cowboy hats in truck stops are people who've committed crimes. Do you know what I mean? Like they go in, don't they? they put the sunglasses on, the hat, yeah. Do they buy it though? 200 IQ there. No, they steal it. Car park got busy. of the montage driving to get here but we're at the Hillcrest Hotel on the edge of Revelstoke so let's check on in here drop off our bags and then and let's down. shut the window because we're in Mosquito Town oh fucking hell okay, get no turn around stop stop the car no one's behind us reverse 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 get me out of Revelstoke now ah! <laughs> welcome to Jurassic Park I'm joking welcome to the Hillcrest Hotel. May not look that much from the front, but let me tell you, it's got a banging view from the back. <laughs> That's what he said. <laughs> um, what? Uh, let's go check out the exit. <laughs> All right, here we go. Home for the night. Hey, massage chairs, that's a great start. Lydia's doing all our details and this is the lounge we're working with. Wow, this is, this is very nice. Pool table, moose, and oh yes, that is what I'm talking about. Hot tub chilling here, people dining and drinking. And would you look at that for a view out the back of the hotel. Flipping hecka, very nice. Very, very, very nice. I bloody love it. It's a proper like lodge vibe. <laughs> This'll do me very nicely. Wait, what's your name? Adam. Adam, <laughs> I'm just there while <laughs> vlogging. I stopped vlogging, he's like, I recognize you. <laughs> hey, nice to meet you, bro. Yeah, nice yeah I'm just staying here for a night. Oh, no. Yeah, you see me around. Sorry. Where are we going? Where are we going? Why do you not know? I've never listened. Oh, for God's sake. Welcome to us walking around a hotel with no idea where we're going. That guy. What? The one behind the desk, you right? Yeah. She was like, the one we went, is he your neighbor from England? She was like, he was like, no. He's a celebrity. Wait, what? No, we don't say the C word, no way. Oh, how, how, how could you have messed that up? The elevator was there, <laughs> the directions are there, and we are there. Stinky? Mm. Smells musky. Welcome to my room tour of the lodge where we're staying, or wherever it is. I think we're gonna have a nice view. 
Let me check. Do we have a nice view? Yes, we do. Oh my gosh, we do. Lovely jubbly. I like it. Just need a bit of a clean window. It's dusty. Grazie for my key. AC is freezing cold. This is my bed. I do bed test. Whoa. Not so bad Lord. test. Little bit, little bit springy, but very nice. Oh, new test, new test, new test. Inter chair test? Internet test. <laughs> I crushed it. And spin test. Very nice chair. I like this chair. It's very good. What's inside here? Nothing. You always know it's a good room when they've got USB plugs in it. I'm now going to do an internet test. Pray for me. Okay, kings, I am connecting to the Hillcrestings. Moment of truth. Will I be doing uploading of videos tonight? Or not? Okay, go. Wow! Good start. Good. St hey, I'll take 30 download. It, however, I'm not downloading anything, so. We need the upload. Okay, let's get you out the yeah, way. Go, 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 go. Songs for the road trip. Yeah. Literally, the entire three hour drive I was driving, she was building playlists on Spotify. Uh, uh... Do you remember the first night we were here and we stayed here? We, we had 200 up, 200 down. I might just go ask him, like, can I sit outside? Can I sit inside your hot tub at the back of your house? and steal your Wi-Fi. Uh, but I think they've got guests there because I checked on Airbnb and it said it was full, so. Ah! I've also been texted by the ginger. He's just asked, where are you? So let's get to the liquor store. Let's get some alcohol bar. Let's get round to his house. Oh, I didn't even finish my hotel tour. Uh, entranceway, very nice and big, spacious. Um, makeup table? I have no idea. Very, very nice, tissues and L lingette wipes. B bathroom, um, soaps, towels, stuff, shower. Ooh, it's a walking one. And it's slidey. You did what? She Wait, did you walk in here with no shoes on? Yeah. What is wrong with you? Why are you strange? <gasps> Ninja flying kick out of nowhere. You yes, I've got a key card. Come on. I can sense your presence. What are you doing? Ah, I've fallen over. Time to go meet with the ginger. Okay, let's hit the road again. By the way, we've decided that we're calling our car's name Lumi. So if anyone for some ever reason wants to create some fan art of me and Lydia adventuring around Canada, then you could draw me and Lydia in the car called Lumi. And if you send me in, like tweet at me or Instagram at me, like tag me in it. If it's good, I might send you some swag. So just saying, well, from Syndicate Original, get some fan art on the way. Okay. We made it into town. Your boys back at the liquor store. And I think it is only right for me to buy... I was going to say buy them a bottle of champagne, but that's the only champagne and it's $329. Prosecco? Prosecco it is. And the crate of beer is for me. And now for something a bit more important than alcohol that's going to disappear, a plant that they are going to like look after in their home that will remind them of us. Which one? Hmm, I like these. Oh, you're thinking of something a bit smaller. Oh, I do like cactuses, yeah, or cacti. I like this one. No, I like this one. I really like this one. Yeah, I, I picked that one, you picked that one, a little cactus family, yeah? Perfect. No, I picked that one, you pick. We're not getting them all three. Oh, fine, fuck it, let's go. That's a, it's annoying, because yeah, I know it, I, I know it. On his I, wallet. <laughs> Yeah, but it's always at the expense of other people. It's not like she's like, oh, buy it for me, buy it for me, buy it for me. It's when we go like present shopping for other people for like the birthdays. She's like, but they'll love this and they'll love this and they'll love this. And I'm like, Fuck. she's always right. Because three of these together will look lovely on like a shelf. So she's right. Okay, a little bottle of bubbly. Some cactuses for the, oh, yeah, cacti. Cactus. Is, is it cacti? Is it cacti or cactuses? I cacti was one. Yeah, cacti. Cactus is small. Yeah, I think you're right. I think you're right. Lydia doesn't want to risk a job. We'd like to clarify right now that it's a cacti is multiple and one is cactus. I think so, yeah. <laughs> Teaching the generations of knowledge. I believe I find the housings. Ginger man. Hello. Aha, I find you. Ginger man, I come with gifts. I come with gifts, ginger man. Congratulations on house. We bring, uh, she brings plants, which is like gifts for a home. Love it. Love it. Love and I bring alcohol. Oh, even better as well. Uh, it gets uh, better and better. What about your champagne, mate? But it could have bought me a house for the yeah. price of it. <laughs> Welcome to the home. When did you get in? Yesterday. No. Today we finished the move. Yes, dude. You're a homeowner in Canada. That's fucking sick. Oh, yes, dude. This is a sick pad. I love it. I love it. I lo yeah, because you said you wanted plants. 
So we got you plants that are not hard to kill. Oh, I'm so glad. I told yeah, you. Yeah, great choice. Great choice. Look at them. Yes. Bathroom slash laundry. Fucking homeowner in Canada. Sick. Oh, Dude, a basement. <laughs> oh my God, it's huge. <gasps> oh my God. What? This is sick. What, you're going to do this up in Airbnb? Eh? No, no, we're going to rent it out. Oh, really? Yeah. Wow. Oh my God. Yeah. Oh shit! Oh, wicked. Oh, yeah, you can do loads with this. It's like double the footprint of the house, isn't it? Yeah, it's literally the same. It's the exact same yeah. upstairs. Wow. You can see why in like all the movies, why like, you know, like the kids have the basement and they turn it into like gaming dens. Like yeah. if I lived in this house and turned this into my gaming den, that'd be sick. Yeah. That is gorgeous. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. I'm so happy for him. I can't wait to see what they do with it because they've got the house, him and Sammy, with a friend. And he does construction and he does and he does roofs, so he's like a labourer as well with him. And they'll just be able to do all the work themselves, which is absolutely epic. So let's go and celebrate with Sammy in the town and listen to some music. You know when you see things and you're like, what the fuck? We're pulling up to the live music and I've just noticed that this person completely forgot to put their cap back on and closed it. Hmm. You may explode. Oh, hey! Fancy seeing you here. Little lanky ginger man. <laughs> Hey, it's Uncle Kevin, I love you. I've not seen you for like five days. We had best adventure ever. Hello! We're back! Congratulations, homeowner! We've just clarified something. So when we were doing this, the rope swing stuff, I woke up the next day like, I'm dying. It was bad, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah. Let alone the mosquito bites. I had, I had muscle pain that I didn't know muscle existed. I had bruising. I had bruising. And I had like... Job, I was taking my, drugs my to help with the pain. My... Do you guys have a tent? <laughs> I'll leave Lydia in the hotel and I'll sleep outside that, that I'll Airbnb. Right. I'll, I'll yeah. just I probably have about 600 gigabytes worth of files yeah, to upload. Just go today. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think they'll mind? Oh my <laughs> Dude, they've got a hot tub in the back. I'm like, can I send them a text being like, yo, let me chill in your hot tub. I'll leave my laptop on the side uploading and I'll just play RuneScape on my phone for like eight hours. Yeah, we have no interest. We've decided we're going to leave the car here, get a taxi home and have a good night. Oh, we have food. Yes, food. Oh, yes, very good. <laughs> Bro, I literally look like your, your child. Jeez, like Dad, Dad, can we please go and get a beer? Can we get another beer? Yeah, let's get another beer. I feel like I'm missing out. The band in there has just kicked off your belief. But I think it's time to get a taxi home. Unbelievable. Oh, God. What is your name on Facebook? <gasps> When are you changing it? Well, apparently you only have a certain amount Now, of time. get on your phone right now and change your name to Cassell. If you're one of us, oh God, you're one of us forever. I don't care How if do I saw the it? ceremony. I don't care if on paper it says you're Cassell. How do you change, you change your name on Facebook? I'm doing it and I'm very Otherwise, you don't exist. Damn it! Are you going to start making YouTube videos again and travel your experience? I don't know, you know. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> You can only give them a chance, like, you know, just get on with it. On the road again. Getting into... I tell you what, it's been nice to have an actual drink and get a taxi home. Bloody hell. The entire time we've been here, it's just like, you have a drink and... You know, that's it at the end of the night. But it's nice to have a few drinks and get a taxi home. So thank you so much. Thank you very much for the ride home. Appreciate you. Now I mean some of the other side of the family because I've... <laughs> I've driven her mom and her dad quite a few oh, times. Oh, yeah? Oh, really? A few times. So, uh, yeah. A few times? Yeah. I feel like I've just jumped out of a Grand Theft Auto taxi. <laughs> like, I shit you not. That driver was sick. She was dead fast. She was super cool. And for us to get home, it cost us, like, six quid. Today's been the first day where we've been allowed to like just switch off, chill out. We've got plans. Check On the plane? Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Suits you, girl. <laughs> Unbelievable. I see it. Oh, I think I've got it. <gasps> oh, you fucking little bastard. I am mad. I kill bug. <laughs> I've got to be quiet because this is a hotel. I'd be a bit of a king. We've had such a good adventure so far. I can't wait to see where it goes. Like, I am so stoked. So if you are, just do me one favor. 
if you're watching this, click the subscribe button, leave a like button, and just tune in. That's it, because it's gonna get madder and madder and madder. We're not even like halfway through the trip yet. I can't wait to share the rest of it with you guys. So I'm gonna go, leave a like button, subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next video. And don't forget, go and buy yourself a Syndicate Original T-shirt. Oh, it's so hard, dude. Oh. Please, because my sister will kill me if you don't. We've just finished now after... Wait, what time is it now? Are we on our 10th day of travelling? It's 1.39, but it feels like 2.39. Oh, my God. we've been yeah, an hour, an hour ahead. ahead yeah. It's our 10th day of travelling officially now. And we've only just watched our first day of getting here. Tired. Have you enjoyed the journey so far? Oh, this is awful. <laughs> Have you enjoyed it though? I've enjoyed it. Not it's been absolutely <laughs> shut up. Jewish. It's been absolutely insane. We just like literally right now. If you guys watching this, we've only just watched back the first vlog. Like shout out to Ryan the editor. He has edited the videos together so well. I used to travel, film, do it all myself. And it just got to a point where it just like, I weren't able to enjoy my holiday because it was ruined by like the, the editing process or like the uploading process or whatever. So it's so nice to be able to have someone on board of this part of this like YouTube family to do it. So I say this right now, if you are watching this guys and you're enjoying it, leave a like, Graham. Subscribe, like if you are not subscribed, please subscribe. Share it with your friends. Tell them to join in on this journey that is this Canadian adventure because it's just going to get, like, it's going to get madder. You do not understand how crazy it's going to get. And without further ado, I cannot wait to see you guys in thanks the next video. Thanks for watching. And Lydia would like to say... Thanks for watching and thanks, Ryan, because I get to keep Tom for the whole day. <laughs> very, very true. So... Leave a like rating for really fast internet. Subscribe and I will see you guys... When it works, if it makes it to YouTube, much love, sadios, and I'll catch you guys next time. Bye-bye!